So the boat came out the shed, uh, the Union Jack doors there, um, on, on its cradle, which we have casters fitted to, just so we can wheel her around the yard. Um, and we stopped it just outside the shed. Uh, we had the keel in the tent just round to the left, um, ready to go. Um, and we just brought that out, set that in front of the boat, um, sort of roughly in line, uh, centrally. Um, and then we, we moved the travel lift over the yacht. Straps on, some plastic protection on the straps because we spent so much time polishing the hull. Um, just pick the hull up, get it aligned onto the keel, um, feed the transducer cable up through its, uh, its little entry hole and everything in the boat and then lower, lower the boat onto the keel, uh, do a dry fit, make sure everything's all good. Uh, she's had some touch-ups on the hull as well where we had some dings and some scratches. Um, but they were all done by hand, uh, all painted in with a paintbrush by hand and then um, sanded back to 2000 grit and polished out. the rudder in, got that connected and then just parked the boat over on the clean side of the yard, um, ready for the mast to go in hopefully the middle of next week. Morty had an operation on one shoulder pre-Christmas and uh, he's damaging the other shoulder. Uh, I understand Anthony O'Leary is going to come and drive the boat uh, for the first two events which is good having you know Ant's got some experience in the class having owned antics so it's a straight swap. Every event now is in the Solent, no one's uncut in Holland, and then only a short trip to Poole for the second event. Um, so it's, it's looking good, but we'll see how it goes. It's, um, hopefully it will be uh, just as good as the last two seasons.